hi today we're going to see how to create a wavy lines text effect in GIMP so first we need to create a new image so go to file new the image width is 1920 and the height is 1080 press ok and now press the minus key in your keyboard to zoom out and now I'm going to change the color of this layer here to black so I'm just going to drag the foreground color like this and now I'm going to create a new transparent layer click on this icon here fill it to transparency and then press ok and now make sure the background color here is white and then go to help search and run a command click and then type blinds so here select this one here simulate an image painted so here left click so here it is and now these are the settings i'm going to use for the orientation horizontal the background don't check the transparent so for example if you check it so here it is and here for the displacement i'm using 62 and for the number of segments i'm using 28 the image size is 1920 in width and uh, 1080 in height so here as you can see the lines here the lines here are white it's using the background color so now press ok so here it is and now i'm going to use the warp tool so I'll select the warp tool so here are the settings here in the tool options the warp transform is move pixels and the size is around 800 hardness 70 the strength is around 50 and the spacing is let's say 15 so interpolation cubic so here are all settings and now i'm just going to move the pixels here like this so as you can see here like this and here i'm going to move this part here in the middle and here the right side like this so i'm going to move this one here like this down here and for this one i'm going to move it down again here this one I'm going to move it up so here i think it's okay and now if i select another tool it will confirm the warp here so i'm going to select tool because i'm going to use it so here as you can see warp transform so it confirmed the warping and now left click here to create a new text box and then i'm going to click here for the letter w the font i'm using is poppins bold and now Control a here to select the letter here all the text box and then i'm going to increase the font size to 1000 so here press enter and now select the alignment tool left click on the text layer and then make sure the align is related to the image and then let's center it horizontally and then vertically like this and now right click on the text layer alpha to selection and now i'm going to hide the text layer this one here select the layer with the lines here with the white lines here right click on it add layer mask and then check the selection layer mask and then add so here it is and now go to select now to remove the selection and now i'm going to apply the layer mask so right click here on the layer here with the white lines here and then apply layer mask and now here we don't need the text layer here so i'm just going to select it and then delete it by pressing the x icon and now i'm going to add some colors here to this w letter here so right click on it alpha to selection and now i'm going to select the gradient tool and for the gradient uh, the shape is linear and the gradient is fg to bg rgb foreground to background rgb and now i'm going to change the foreground color here so double click on the html notation and now i'm going to type 42 d a d c press enter it's a light blue color press ok and for the foreground uh, for the background sorry click on the background and then double click on the html notation and now i'm going to type 42 d c 7 e press enter and then press ok and now i'm just going to trace the gradient here so like this 
so now press enter and now go to select none to remove the selection and so here it is that's how we can create a wavy text effect in game thanks for watching have a nice day and uh, till next time